Assalamu alaikum. I'm Dr. Muhammad Umar Salim, consultant pulmonologist. So, uh, we were discussing uh, FCPS pulmonology April 2015 paper. The next question is on your screen now. A 65 years old woman, 30 pack years current smoker, presented with weight loss and dry cough. Contrast enhanced CT chest showed right upper lobe mass and lymph nodes in paratracheal, subcarinal, and hilar region. There was no evidence of metastasis. Bronchoscopy showed lesion at carina and immunohistochemistry was positive for CK7 and TTF1 while it was negative for CK56, P63, synaptophysin and chromogranin. Part A of the question is what is the diagnosis? Part B is what is the TNM of this patient? Write 8 neurological paraneoblastic syndromes is question part C. Okay. As it is very clear in the question that they are asking about the lung carcinoma, the respiratory symptoms with weight loss and dry cough and they have mentioned already the CT findings, bronchoscopy findings as well as histopathological findings associated with immunohistochemistry. So you can see that the adenocarcinoma has immunohistochemistry positive for CK7 and TTF1. And they have clearly mentioned that CK56, which is for the squamous cell carcinoma, is negative. So, our diagnosis is adenocarcinoma lung. Okay. Part B of this question is what is the TNM of this patient? So, the tumor nodes and metastasis, which is also called TNM classification. Um, I will mention the answer according to the eighth edition of TNM classification. Uh, the tumor or T will be 4 because the, the bronchoscopy shows lesion at carina. If the patient has lesion at carina, it is already T4. Okay. The nodes are uh, paratracheal, subcarinal and hilar region. This is specific for N2. These are N2 nodes. So T4, N2 and they have already uh, mentioned that there is no evidence of met metastasis. So, T4, N2, M0, which is 3B, 3B stage of the patient. Three. So, the T4, N2 and M0 is the 3B stage of the lung cancer, of the adenocarcinoma lung, okay. Part C will be Lambert-Eaton syndrome, encephalomyelitis, cerebellar degeneration, sensory neuropathy, opsoclonus, myoclonus, autonomic neuropathy, mononeuritis multiplex and myopathy. So, this was question. 15 of April 2015. I hope you understand and if you have any queries regarding the question, please comment me in the comment box. Thank you so much. For more solved cases, SAQs, SBAs, MCQs, get these books from local, international and online bookstores. The link is given in description box.